Hi, welcome back. So already one day, I think after getting the last software update, I just got, just finished downloading 2021.44.30.7. Um, we're going to check it out. I don't know that there's a lot of differences. I know a few details I'll go over with you. But one thing I did notice um, when I got 2021.44.30.6, I didn't notice it till after I made my video, is when I tried to voice control a text, I would say, you know, text so-and-so, and the car would bring up the phone interface. So I couldn't voice text that way. If someone texted me, I could reply and everything worked as expected. But if I wanted to initiate a text using voice commands by saying text so-and-so, it was not working. So I'm hoping that's corrected in 2021.44.30.7, which we're going to review right now. So I'm going to flip the camera around and we're going to take a look. Okay. So as you can see, we've got 2021.44.30.7. It's updated today. Um, uh, you can see I have premium connectivity. So, so far the display doesn't look any different, right? Um, but let's just check the release notes and see if there is anything at all very different. Uh, let's take a look, we'll let it load, and we will see. This may end up not being a very long video, but we will find out. So, it, okay, so we've got, yeah, it looks like everything is the same. Uh, as the holiday update. So if you want to see in depth on any of these, go back and watch my holiday update video and you will see a description of all of this, of the light show, the app launcher, the controls, blind spot. Nothing here looks like it's new uh, at all. Um, so one thing they're saying is in 44.6, uh, they improved door lock mode and driver profile improvements. But driver door unlock mode was in the holiday update where you can say if you unlock, only unlock the driver door. Um, so I don't see anything different here, um, you know, that, I, that I'm uh, noticing. Um, one thing I do know that was different, so let's go down here. I want to show you one thing I know that came in, I believe, I don't know if it's with this one. I noticed it. Let's see if I go to... Um, hmm, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I think it's autopilot. Yeah, here it is. Oops, oops, oops. Hang on. I apologize for that. So this one, blind spot collision warning. One cool thing about this, it came in either in the last update, 0.6 or the other one, and I just noticed it. But what's nice about it is when it gives the chime, they are localized. So if it's in the back left corner of my car, that speaker, the chime is the loudest. If it's in the back right, that speaker, the chime is the loudest. It's really nice. So you could use that as opposed to the blind spot camera. The only thing about this is that you hear a chime when a potential is collision is detected while leaving the lane. So it's not in advance of leaving the lane. So that's the only thing I don't love necessarily about that. Now, one thing I wanted to check because they're saying you can do the light show all year long, which I know that, but what I wanted to see is, um, where is it? Where is it? Um, do, 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 hmm, where is the light show? Uh, oh, light show. What is this going to do? Uh, okay, no. So I thought you could customize the light show. I don't know why I thought I had read something, but apparently not. So let me turn the camera back around. So everything I've read said that this is they needed more updates for the heat pump issues, which affect Model 3s that are newer, like this one, 2021 Model 3s, uh, and also all Model Ys that have heat pumps. They are still having issues. Uh, apparently, 2021.44.30.6 did not correct them, and there are still more reports of people's heat being lost even while driving. Uh, so this is supposed to address some of that. Now, I'm going to test whether or not the texting works. So we're going to do that right now. I'm going to press the button and see what happens. Let's try it. Text mom. No, it brings up the phone interface again. So the phone interface comes up. So not good. Uh, they've got to fix that. I don't know why that happens. So that still has not been resolved. So as an overview, there's not a whole lot new in um, 2021.44.30.7 that is 
was not really as far back as the holiday update. Most of the features are the same. I know they've been struggling with the heat pump improvements in the last two updates. And as I said, those warning chimes I discovered when you, wherever the collision may be, it focuses the sound in those corners. So that's something I discovered that's slightly new. Um, and, and again, it's, it's, I think it's a good feature. I like that it does that with the sound and kind of, you know, you can automatically know, even if you, you know, you can't glance down at the screen, you'll know right where it's talking about, which is nice because it focuses the sound. So that's pretty much my review. It's not a huge update. I wanted to get it out to you guys and let you know that. Um, thanks for watching again it, you know if if you have subscribed i appreciate it thank you if not consider clicking subscribe like share it really helps out the channel so thank you and we'll see you next time